so as I told you I'm alone right now I'm waiting for Matt my friend uh, and we are going to the haunted museum uh, downtown um, Matt invited me and his mom I think his mom bought the ticket so uh, poker mom thank you very much uh, for inviting us for that um, I guess we're going for a flashlight tour in the hunted museum it's um, it starts at a quarter to midnight and there are only I think uh, a group of people are only allowed in there and I, I don't I don't really know what we're gonna do so Matt most knows more I'm here at the place where Matt lives and uh, waiting for him he's coming here and uh, then we go together obviously I cannot take the uh, the camera with me they don't allow uh, video filming in there but um, I don't know we're gonna explain what we did and uh, how it was uh, after the tour okay the tour is gonna be I think one and a half hours <laughs> uh, we tell you later Something's touching my shoulder. I move it up to his shoulder, then I just feel like a little breeze or a little gust is kind of coming right up my arm. <laughs> <laughs> so you start hearing some stories. As you know, I did not know what uh, what we're gonna do over here. I thought it's like uh, like a haunted house or something, so little uh, uh, horror movie scenario thing. But I guess. Um, this is the real deal over here. Come on over here, Matt. Maybe then you can explain a little bit. Because Matt told me um, that he was here already, what, twice? Yeah, for the flashlight tour, twice. Twice for the flashlight tour and in the museum without the flashlight tour. Oh, by, by the way, flashlight tour means we're having this stuff well, here. You get <laughs> lights are off. Lights are off. Um, so explain a little bit. You you were here several times already on daytime too. So in total right. was that what eight times you said? Yeah, around eight. Okay. What are we gonna do here? We are basically going on a ghost hunt, seeing if anything wants to interact with us inside uh, Zach's museum. Okay. We have we have the flashlights and we get something else, right? We get a EMF meter, which will help a ghost. It'll kind of tell you if something a spirit is close to you, and then you get a spirit box, which uh, the spirits can try to talk to you through if they want to <laughs> you already told me that in the car and I almost shit myself over there the last it is crazy because the last days I just started watching uh, on YouTube these uh, these guys that can talk to the dead like the um, um, how are they called the mediums so uh, it is just unbelievable for me how they talk to them uh, I don't even know all the names that I saw. The young guys, and it's uh, crazy. Now he's coming up with, do you want to come with me over there? And I thought, okay, let's go. Let's do something. Let's have some fun. And it's not even li like the thing that I thought it is, like the Fright Dome at, C uh, at Circus Circus, where there are some monsters and stuff. No, this here is the real deal. And it's, uh, I think it's the number one haunted museum uh, in the US, right? Absolutely. Uh, I don't know. Alright. Okay. <laughs> now I'm still smiling. I, it might be different when we're coming back. Obviously, we cannot take the camera, but uh, we're gonna tell you afterwards when you see all. Uh, when we saw <laughs> all, all the ghosts in there. <laughs> I don't I don't really know, know what to say either. Holy shit. 
that was a good one that's for sure wow Ooh, that was uh, that was um, something for me unexpected my bad um, yeah no 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 it was it was fun it was fun it was uh, informative uh, he knows a lot of stuff uh, thank god that he was uh, there before uh, so he could explain some of the stuff to me um, so the two main things in there is the basement and that box the big box the, the big box um, these were scary uh, the, the other group the the girl she she said when they were in the basement we, we heard them scream when they were in the basement that was the first 45 minutes that we went in there um, they were first in the basement and she said somebody grabbed her leg uh, or she felt that somebody hold her back when they wanted to leave the basement and uh, she even uh, hit she the fell on the stairs and fell hit her on leg the stairs and hit her because legs. somebody grabbed like her her ankle or the back of her leg so she was really shaking when we when we saw her in there and now she just told me that again that uh, uh, that was scary I mean when we were down there uh, it was also the spirit box was talking a lot and yeah the 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 first thing that uh really i um felt or that uh i understand how that whole thing works was when we went to the uh to the doll um to the oh, doll the room with the two yeah. with the two uh, uh dolls. Gretchen and cynthia yeah uh we had um so um, i was the one holding the EMF meter. Yeah, I'm sorry guys. I don't know all the words from that uh, what, what we're holding. So I was holding that and it um, it goes with the with the lights uh, as many lights as you have as uh, more strong is the spirit that is around. So and that one uh, doll had that was, uh, was Cynthia. The, almost the last uh, yeah. um, uh, light was showing. Lights, yeah. yeah, so um, four out of five. She talked a little bit talked so she um, you had that other thing I don't, the I don't know box. the spirit box so um, we try to talk a little bit uh, but in other rooms it's unbelievable now the last one where we were in um, that had the last minute in the no 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 and no, no, I don't mean that I'm we, we tell them about that too <laughs> but um, the other one where it says your name so oh, uh, what was that Peggy's room oh, Pe so we went in there and it was also a doll and he's he's she asked her can you say my name and he didn't mention his name he didn't say that i'm hi i'm mad uh, this is kevin can you say our names he tried it in other rooms in this room he just said can you say my name and she said matt you could hear it really clear she said matt she didn't say my name <laughs> Probably she didn't we, know. We asked to say his name and it said, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, that's what she said. I don't know. But it's it's weird. It's For me, it's so weird. Especially because I just started getting into that stuff. Uh, and we're going here and this, this is really something. I was a little bit scared. I uh, can tell you when we went to that to that box, even that I didn't know what, uh, what the whole thing means. But... Um, after he told me the whole story, I go like, eh, I don't want to go too close to that one. Uh, but there was uh, spirit around also. We had some, uh, some Ausschlag <laughs> in the box. The box said, yeah, there's somebody in that one corner. Um, we had quite, quite some rooms where we had some, uh, it was in the reaction. Yeah, it was active. Other, other groups didn't have that much. Um, so, yeah, thank you very much, uh, Poker Mama. Thank you very much for uh, inviting me too. Um, that was uh, that was an ex ex um, uh, experience. Uh, in, in uh, what is that name? Uh, ex, ex. No. Um, what, what are you thinking of? Uh, that was quite a adventure. Adventure. <laughs> adventure. That's what it is. That was quite an adventure. <laughs> I probably cut that out <laughs> and put it in there. That was an adventure. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, Hunted House, you know where it is. Here in Las Vegas, have fun. And if you need a guide, take Matt with you. He knows it. <laughs>
Okay, so there's one thing uh, Matt just uh, remind me of. So the last thing uh, we had about a minute left uh, oh, before yeah. before it was done, and in that in that room, the devil's rocking chair, you know, where the chair was in, uh, they have that little box standing under that chair. Uh, in, in several rooms, they have one of these boxes, and it, it's uh, called a REM pod. A REM pod. And it goes. Explain it. Why? Why? To, uh, it the stupid German tries to explain the stuff that the American knows. So it's you explain. It's called a REM pod, and it'll go off. It'll give off a very strong beep when uh, something comes very, very near it or wants to touch it. And we were all standing out in the hallway waiting for the tour to end. And all of a sudden, you hear this. And it was like everybody's like, "What is that?" And I was like, "That's the REM pod and the rocking devil's rocking chair." So we went in there. I turned on my spirit box and I asked it, I was like, can you say your name? Who's here? And it says, no. Yeah, it was speaking too. It was like, do you want to communicate with us? No. Yeah. Uh, it was crazy shit. <laughs> it's like for the last two minutes. <sighs> Good night. I hope I'm going to sleep tonight. <laughs>